Hello, good morning and welcome to PGTV. We're fishing the beautiful Hampshire a Avon for uh, Atlantic Salmon today and I've moved across from the Flying Seas to the MEPS 5 Coppers. I'll just show you what it looks like, just bear with me. So there's your Copper MEPS 5. It's got a red and yellow beaded body, hooks. So that I've got a small little swivel, no more than about 8 inches of fluorocarbon off that. We have 20 pound fluorocarbon on the rest of the rod all the way down to my spinning wheel. We're fishing the top of Harbridge Bend. The water levels have uh, calmed down a bit. In the spring, this is powering through on this bend and you can't fish it. I'll just show you the water. Um, but there's a nice gentle glide coming through here. So we're gonna go up and uh, put the MEPS up there. I've had one fish up there already three weeks ago on the MEP. I suspect there could be another one lying up there. We'll have a look, see how we get on. All right, this is the uh, top of Harbridge Bend. Lower cabbage is around there. Harbridge Bend is here. Just look at the V coming off here, gravel bar here, 11 foot hole underneath here. When the floods come through, they've created that big back eddy for big perch and chub. Lily pad swim, obviously that's for your course fishing. The salmon are likely to lie up on this glide here, nice slow glide, big salmon would lie here. And uh, we have plummeted this, there's 11 foot hole right underneath us. So on these conditions, we're on the 1st of July, uh, there's a good chance the salmon would be lying up in these deep holes. So we're going to do a number of casts with the MEP. I'm fishing that copper MEP 5. So we're going to flick her out, give her a few seconds and we're going to do a slight downward on the dangle slow movement. Because it's a slow pull we can fish this downstream and we're going to work it very slowly. These salmon are lethargic and they won't chase MEPs unless they're grills. We've got some grills up as well but just slowly, slowly, slowly towards us. And then that gives the salmon a chance to come and follow and hit it. Plenty of time to think about it. And that's what we're after. So I'm fishing with my friend Harry today. He's fishing the shrimp. And he's gonna go around the bend and uh, he's gonna be paternostering the shrimp. And there's the action in the water. Beautiful. So we gonna cast just on the edge of the gravel bar. Very shallow there. And then let that curve around like a fly through the pool, keep the rod tipped down, and then just let that go. Now the sun's come out, so I can see the MEP, it's glowing like a disco light, lighting up the pool, and there'll be any salmon within a 20 foot radius will see that. We've got six feet of visibility, we've had some rain earlier, the sun's poked out, the conditions are looking good, and we're up to 88 salmon on the estate. We're going for 90, I'm on 25, so let's see whether we can increase the number. There, see how the sun's hitting that? It's really glowing beautifully, and the salmon do not like that in their eyes. So we go out, cast it out. Beautiful, perfect cast, right on the lie. That's where I had the fish earlier on. So we let that come round nice and slowly. And I tell you, this is working so slowly that if there is a salmon there, he will take it. It's not rushing at all. Let that go through. And that's working absolutely beautifully. Wonderful. This is coming under this bit here. Oh, and we've got a hit. Yes, we're, we're in. It's a nice one, Harry. Salmon on. Wow. Fish number 26. Oh, it's stripping me. It's gone to the far bank. No, this is okay, this is perfect. Yeah. Boy, this is a very good fish, it's, it's a 15 pounder. It's a big fish. If you can move that fly rod for me, Harry. We'll bring it back. This is a big salmon, mate. I thought this was a salmon. Second salmon out of this pool here on the MEP. That's a really slow retrieve, he really wanted that. From where? Um... Right here. Oh, wow, what a beautiful fish, this is beautiful fish oh he's taking me down very strong very powerful fish Harry but it just felt fishy didn't it <laughs> he's stripping me he's stripping me it's a lovely fish it's a nice place to take one but I tell you what he's powerful wow I've set my goal for 30 and if I can land him this will be 26 so but I'll tell you one thing, this is no easy fish. This is very powerful. Very powerful, Harry. 
It was a slow mep, down straight, downstream mep. Oh, just look at it go, look at it go, power. Oh, oh. what's the what's It's taking me down the pool. It's taking me right the way down. Oh, oh, powerful fish. It's taking me into the weeds. Still move, there he is. It's a big fish, it's a fresh fish, Harry. Oh. There he is. It looks like a free winter. Oh, here he is, Harry, you can land him for me here. Here he is. Can you, can you land him for me? Can you land him? Get the net in, get the net in. Net in. Get it down, come on. Oh, come on, Harry. Got him. Oh. Oh. This is a 15 pounder if I've seen one. Maybe getting on for 20. Right, I'm gonna reverse him back. Come to the come to the fish, Harry. You're gonna have to come to the fish. There you go. There you go. There you go. Go on. You got him. Hold him in the water. Fish 26. Wow! Thank you so much. It's about 18, 16, 17. Lovely fish. Oh, I'm so pleased, so pleased. All right, thanks, Harry. I'll take him now. We're walking down, shall we? Actually, this back end is quite a good place, but there is a bit down here. Yeah. He really wanted that copper, didn't he? That lovely fresh fish. Yeah. It's got to be at least well, six, 16. Pretty fresh. 16? Fresh, yeah, good 16. Right, should we walk him down? You take the rod, I'll walk him down. Ah, I thought it was a pike to start with, but I'll tell you what. <laughs> well, that's where I had the fish last time, Harry. That's why I wanted to put the map on it. Yeah. yeah, I had the other fish there in a similar, similar spot. Right, we're on the bar. Let's recover him. That's a lovely looking fish. Oh. Oh. Fish 26. Wow, that'll do. As long as I don't touch the map, he's really taken that right in the scissors. All right, let's see if he, that's a good fish. Gently ease it out. Out, out we go, hooks are out. Fish can recover now. I'm just gotta get the fish to recover. If I can just get, oh yeah, that's 16. That's 16, all right. He's still, very active. I mean, I only played them halfway. So it's all done moving up. Well, ladies and gentlemen, we've just taken a 16 pound silver bar. It's uh, fish number 26 for me at Harbridge Bend. At the top end on the MEP. It was a MEP copper. I'm gonna show you the fish. Fishing with Harry, my mate, and uh, we both come out together in search of these Atlantic salmon. And now I'm gonna show you how beautiful this fish is. Just look at that, ladies and gentlemen, what a fish. Beautiful, beautiful silver bar, and now we're going to return him. You point the camera down, Harry. And then we'll just get him on the flow. 